Hi, I'm Benjamin from OptimaTrays.com. Here I'm going to show you how to assemble your slip clamp tray. The slip clamp tray is used when the battery needs to be installed up against a fender wall or something else that prevents you from getting access to the back screws once the battery is set in place. So before you install your battery into the vehicle, first what we need to do is install the slip clamp. The slip clamp is the clamp that's designated by 34-SC for slip clamp and can also be noticed by the more round points. First, set that on the battery tray and insert the three screws. Now these three screws can be tightened down all the way right from the beginning. Next, install your battery tray in the place where it's going up against the fender wall. Now notice you won't have access to the th two 3 8 bolts there, so you'll have six other points to mount your battery tray. Once you mount your battery tray into the vehicle in its final location and the slip clamp is on, it's time to put the battery in. To put the battery in, we're going to lift it and simply slip it in underneath the slip clamp. It'll have just enough room. Once it locks in place down into the pocket, it's time to install the front rigid clamp. Simply set it in place, and then insert your three screws. Go ahead and tighten these down, and you'll be done. This is the way to install the slip clamp tray up against a fender wall where you only need access to the front bolts. And now your battery is securely held in place.